Uh, just regarding food independence of Europe, according to the World Economic Forum dictates, European countries have to shut down farms. In Holland, they're already shutting down, was it 1,000 or 3,000 farms? I can't remember how many thousand farms. They've said they're gonna buy out the farms for 120%, right? So 20% more than market value. And any farmer that they buy out, those farmers will no longer be allowed to go into farming anywhere in the EU. So just imagine your profession is farming. You've been far farming family. For generations, you've been farming. And the government comes out and says, we're gonna buy your farm for 120%, okay? So 20% over mar market value. If the farmer says no, the government's gonna shut them down anyway, okay? So the government's gonna shut you down anyway if you say no. So you either take the deal or the government's gonna shut you down. If you take the deal, sign your name, you won't be allowed to farm inside the EU, right? So that means if you wanna get into farming, you're gonna pack up everything you have, get the fuck out of EU. That's gonna create food shortages. Guaranteed, guaranteed, guaranteed. Inflation through the roof. Inflation through the roof. And 100% there's food shortages in Europe right now. In the UK, egg shortages, okay? That we know for sure, that there haven't been eggs there. So some days there are no eggs on the shelves, right? Aside from that, there's been multiple sanctions packages against Russia. And from what we understand, the EU is about to put another sanction, secondary, 11th or 12th sanction, but a secondary sanction against Russia, sanctioning any country that is selling, dealing with Russia in terms of food. So if they're going to start sanctioning other countries right and other corporations that are dealing in food products with russia doing doing trade with russia that means a lot of food imports into europe are gonna trickle down to zero right because corporations won't be able to sell food to europe okay aside from that europe is not food independent no way no how this this africa has been feeding Europe for decades upon decades, if not centuries, okay? All the flowers that you see in Europe being sold in the corner stores, they're all grown in Africa, and some in Holland, right? But a shit ton in Africa. We talked about it, Lake Victoria, major food source for Europe, fish coming to Europe, okay? So no, Europe isn't deep shit. Look, gang, that has to be clear now, right?